Good evening, 2143, 22nd of February, 2022. And uh, yeah, of course, if you are watching news anywhere in the world, uh, you probably noticed that uh, Russia and Ukraine are now basically at war and uh, there is a war basically declared by Vladimir Putin yesterday so the markets are not reacting as I actually was supposed to I, I suppose the fear didn't kick in yet or maybe people will think that it is isolated conflict but uh, all is growing thanks to that a little bit so all will fall off don't, don't worry about that it will fall off very soon uh, but uh, the, the ongoing conflict is basically pushing oils higher the prices because we don't know what will happen and uh, yeah ethereum bitcoin and also snp are pushed down by the conflict snp now on very critical support we need to hold it if we will not hold it we are going down up here to 4200 and then much lower ethereum bitcoin the same situation as we were talking before so i'm expecting this support to get tested soon uh i was expecting much bigger sales today much bigger much bigger sell-off we basically stopped here on this smaller support this one is big this is a smaller support and we already got rejected the volume goes down which is very interesting son i'm not sure what should i think about it the volume is extremely low so that means people are feared fear index 20 this means that everyone is basically screaming sell 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 and uh, you don't want to do that shopify however now my favorite stock to buy it's uh ridiculous i mean look at this we are 44 percent from weekly 21 emma that's extreme extremely undervalued stock uh there as i showed you yesterday their uh balance sheet and cash flow and everything is pretty all right they are not growing as super fast and super big as before but uh, they are still growing slowly that the rate is slower but they are still growing it will be okay and this stock will recover very very soon maybe we are now testing this support yeah here i'm not sure why it stopped here there is like almost non-support here so this is very strange i suppose we will stop here about 990 591 then we will we can retest it and go down until this 300 super support or maybe stop here and uh, the sell off was big yesterday today not really if we will switch to daily you can see that the sell off is coming down so it's losing strength and um, yeah Shopify was very heavily undervalued, uh, overvalued, and now it's heavily undervalued. Yeah, so we are looking now for the mean. And yesterday I showed you Fibonacci, and if we will do Fibonacci like this, here is the mean. Okay, so mean is 851. So I showed you yesterday that if you would buy now, you would be 37% in profit. I suppose this year or maybe next, but very soon. Yeah, soon means like year or more okay so we are in the stocks so when i say soon i don't mean tomorrow <laughs> of course S soon tomorrow would be for ethereum or bitcoin this is much much higher pace of speed but uh, normal markets stock markets they are much slower they have much slower recovery but you can see that very steep sell-offs extremely steep sell-offs which this sell off I, I i i don't know it's it's very extreme very oversold uh, stock now shopify so yeah uh, just wanted to react to yesterday's uh, russia's situation versus ukraine and uh, yeah doesn't look good most probably we, are, we have a war ahead of, ahead of us and uh, yeah let's see how it will go this week but uh, 
I don't think nothing good is ha will happen. I, I suppose we will sell off and it will get worse because Russia is not backing off at all. So count on that. It's very difficult times now, very hard. And in these difficult times, we need to hold. Don't sell anything, hold or buy. If you have some extra money, you can buy these big sell-offs. So you can buy with a discount, but uh, I would wait if I were you. Uh, it will probably go lower because now it is a huge tension. And market still didn't count it. I don't I don't see the tension here yet with Russia. I mean, this, this was a little bit of a tension, but the fear of Russia would be extreme. Yeah, so it, it would go somewhere to 20k. So we didn't see that. And that's a good and uh, let's see we will see something like that we didn't see a capitulation of the market on any sides yeah this would be this is the capitulation so huge steep sell-off this is not capitulation yet it's a mild correction i would say so yeah just wait just hold be strong and uh, i'll see you tomorrow